Would you date a full time YouTuber? Full time YouTuber for would a you? bit. Yeah. That sounds like an experience. <laughs> for a bit, I'll waste this time bit. for a little like, bit. Yeah, I would like. Yeah, that sounds you like an adventure. You wouldn't marry a YouTuber. What's your husband doing? He's a YouTuber. Oh, I don't think I don't think like that. I don't think like oh, it's a it's it's a, a shame to be the title. It's not about the title. It's about the experience. Okay. And mm. being with a YouTuber means that like everything is on camera all the time, and that your life is up for display. Yep. And that I don't like. Okay. How about you? I would if I resonated with the things that he was doing. Like if I can be involved in what he's doing and we can build together. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't have a problem. By the way, how important is your man's career? Like what? What he does? Yeah, exactly. How important is that? As a, to a woman I mean very important like I always thought I wanted to date a businessman right mm -hmm. and then when I started hanging around businessmen I'm like I can't with them being on the phone 24-7 like if we're at dinner like we need to sit down and have a conversation Good I don't need point. just leaving every five seconds to talk on the phone okay so for me it's not about his career but his relationship to it Hmm. Oh. If, if he is like somebody who's very passionate about what they do like I like that because it's energy and somebody who's getting up and happy to do what they do but if your career is draining you that permeates into the relationship but what if he's so passionate about it that it's his priority and it's kind of just overstepping you yeah. to the point where like you're too passionate about that and not enough about me um, I don't I think that pe everybody's always searching for balance all the time it's yeah. hard to have a passion and still have room for the people in your life as well so I wouldn't discredit it. I'd be like, this is something we got to work on. But mm. I'm also a super passionate person. Would you rather date a guy uh, who makes a good money, good income, but has zero social cred, has zero social media. He's like a nobody to the world, but he does well for himself. Or major influencer. Everybody knows this person. Social clout. But ain't making yeah. no money. The what would number you think? Number, one. number, one. number yeah. one. I didn't ask you, David. I'm asking the ladies. <laughs> what men are you dating? Go ahead. Amber, who would you rather? Adam. Uh, for sure, the off the radar guy. For sure, off the radar. Off the radar, makes yeah. money, folds laundry, does your thing. Yeah. You don't care about his social media. Jenny, you have a different opinion? Off the radar. Off the I radar. I actually hate when men have social it's, media. So is it it's not a, a turn on? It's not. It's, it's not that it's not a turn on or it is a turn on. It's just the things that it comes with. Like, people think they want to be famous until they see what fame comes with. And, mm -hmm. like, going out to eat in a restaurant and you can't have dinner because people are constantly taking pictures of you, like, that's annoying as blank. You can curse. You That's, blank. That's blank. That's <laughs> blank. Amber. But by the way, speaking of uh, social media, YouTube, I've heard you do a joke about OnlyFans, about like your oh. calves or something. Yeah. Enlighten us. What's that? Um, just the things that I Because by the way, can... Amber is a, is a dancing comedian. I am, because I'm a professional dancer turned comedian because I love right. being broke. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I love it so much. I'm so good at it. Uh, talking about ways I could make money. There are lots of ways as women that we can make money, by the way. And like, I don't know how you're going to raise daughters to be like, hey, I know people are going to want to pay you to sell your body, sell your fart, sell your underwear online. It's true. Yeah. <laughs> is that a thing? Yeah. You didn't hear about the girl who made fifty thousand dollars selling her farts? No. In a yeah. jar. I, to be yeah. honest with you, you guys in a didn't jar. hear about this. I, I thought honest, it would be on that. the TV for sure. She made fifty thousand dollars in a week selling her wow. farts in a jar. She to was be honest with you, I didn't even know that girls farted. <laughs> <laughs> we don't. It's a lie. Anyway, That's my true. point is, I don't know how you raise a daughter to there be like go. your your morals are more important than money. So what did you decide to do? Anyway, my point is, I have calves that are, I guess, pretty muscular. I don't know if you can see them. Yeah, those are some, those are some thick ass calves, <laughs> some girl. Thick -ass calves. With I've three had them. C's, them thick. And guys message me Ridiculous. on Instagram all the time to send them pictures for money and of videos your calves? of my calves, just my calves, nothing else, just Amber, the legs. Amber, let me be your agent. I swear to God, there's <laughs> no shame in the game of just being like, boom, calf. Pick. Can I? I mean, be a calf model? Like that's if I can make money, I'll do it. Have you ever considered it? Just I send have sent. Of a course. Picture. She's Okay. Of course I sent a picture. It was like 80 bucks, the fastest 80 bucks I've ever made. Fuck yeah. Amber, go down that path. <laughs> but like, should be the richest, I just feel Canadian. so silly, guys. I just feel so silly. They're like, can you flare them out for me? You really only have to take one picture and send it. That's it. I know. Every, to everyone else. Okay. It, it becomes weirder. They start getting weirder. It's never just that. Then they're like, can you do this? Can you do that? Can you wiggle them around? <laughs> can you wiggle them around? Can you jump can you on push the ground? Them together can you like wiggle this? all around? Right, can then, you push them together? <laughs> Can you tie them in or not? And then it goes to feet because they're always the calf the people are feet people. <laughs> it makes its way down. <laughs> it's not, it's, yeah, so it's never enough. a little bit lower. I know. Lower. It, lower, lower, it starts with the calves. The Next thing you know, it's down to the pinky toe. <laughs> By the way, do you get any weird requests online <laughs> like that? Very, very. What kind of weird stuff? Not calf stuff. What? Just 
Weird fetish All kind stuff. Of thing, yeah. yeah. Do you want to talk about it or no? no <laughs> <laughs> Jenny, who is Latina living limitless, has no problem. That's getting, the limit. That's the <laughs> limit. That is the limit yeah. right there. The limit you right there. You guys do come up with the weirdest fucking things to say into our DMs. Like, I don't know if you're just trying to get attention or what. Guys almost sometimes insult you and then you respond. You're like, <laughs> no. fuck you. And then they hit on you and you're like, what? What? Pick a lane. Uh, gotcha. Pick gotcha. a lane. Yeah, they do. They anyway, do. so ladies and gentlemen, that is how you make money on YouTube. What a great segue right Woo! there. Okay. So speaking Keeping of it's under an hour. Exactly. 